Welcome to the Laurel Martin Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray, joined now with Stevenson Field Hockey head coach Laurel Martin. And coach, maybe not the season you had hoped for going into the year. Finish just one win shy of the MAC Commonwealth playoffs. Right. Talk about the season as a whole. I think the season as a whole, obviously a disappointment to not make postseason play, but as a whole, we played some really, really phenomenal field hockey. Um, at one point in stage, we were ranked ninth in the country for strength of schedule. We played the best teams. We competed against them. Um, we're, just, we're just one step shy of, of actually making it into the ring. When you look back at the year, and mm -hmm. you say you, t you played very you know, tough opponents, of your 11 losses, eight of them were one goal loss. Right. Is that something that you kind of, you know, you know, hold your head high on that, that you competed with some of those best teams? Yeah, I mean, I think you have to. I mean, you either are going to be proud of what we've accomplished or, or you're going to cry because we were one goal shy every time. Um, so I, I think that the girls competed and, uh, and being one goal shy against some major com opponents, you know, Salisbury made the NCAA tournament. Messiah, of course, in our conference made the NCAA tournament. Rowan made the final four. And um, we're just, we're there, we're close, um, and we're just going to continue to strive to get better. Yeah, as you turn the page to, to the next year, you, you mm -hmm. lose a big group of seniors. We do. Uh, important players, too. Yeah. But you bring back some some young talent, Brooke Morris, Brigitte, Zorak, yeah. uh, even Kelsey Yer in net. So talk about yeah. how you, you transition into the next year. So I think the transition has to begin now, and the girls are already doing it. So they're already starting to do their off-season lifting, um, and they're talking to me about what playing opportunities could be coming up here um, for the winter time frame. So in Division Three, you have to have the leadership and the, um, and the drive to do things on your own um, due to our limitations as a coaching staff to be able to you know, be a part of them day in and day out. So they're starting to do that. We've got some great leadership coming up um, and they're hitting the weight room hard. So we're looking forward to good things in the future. Yeah, and before we let you go here, as you, as you make that transition into the next year, what's the mm -hmm. biggest thing that you wanna see your team improve on? You know, I, I think we just need to um, strive on off-season training, you know, quite honestly. I think that um, we need to have the drive to do the things that we need to do in the off-season and um, become united uh, as a team is one of the things we've always had. You know, we get along great. We, you know, we have a great team, a good bunch of girls. And the next step is going to be what can they do collectively um, on the offseason to elevate us to that next level. Well, Coach, thank you for your time this year, and good thank luck you. in the offseason. Thank you. For Head Coach Laurel Martin, I'm Sam Murray, and this has been the Laurel Martin Show.